guys, Noah from Kicking Their Bass TV here with another unboxing and it's over the Mystery Tackle Box for the month of September. Um, so let's go ahead and jump right into it. I don't want to do an MT MTV Slam. Um, I don't know if I'm going to have time to do it. I'm actually practicing for a tournament and if I go out tomorrow, I don't know if I'm going to be using this stuff, especially most of the stuff like shallow water stuff and that's not where I'm fishing. So I don't know how that's going to work. If I do, it might be a little bit later on in the month. Um, let's go ahead and start it off. The first bait in the box is a spit and wall, which is pretty much a popping frog. This is by River to Sea. Um, pretty much River to Sea has been in most of the mystery tackle boxes, and their baits are look pretty solid to be completely honest. This color is a black with some blue um, dots on the top, and it's called Poison. Um, pretty neat frog. Those are pretty good and like grass and stuff. If I was fishing lily pads, you can't throw it. Um, I would more than likely use a standard frog, but if I was fishing by grass and stuff, I want a little bit more um, action in it. I would go with the popping frog. Going on to the second bait in the box. This is a live wire buzz bait. Um, this is by Custom Lures Unlimited. This is pretty much just a standard white buzz bait. Um, pretty simple as it gets, just a standard buzz bait. Um, the wire is fairly long um, compared to most of them. And it looks pretty solid to me. Um, it's kind of a pearl color. It's not exactly just bland white. It's kind of pearlish. has a little bit of blue shine to it. Going on to the third bait in the box. It's by Charlie's Warners and this is just a regular um, finesse one. And this one is actually in black and it has a little bit of sparkles in it. Honestly, I could drop shot this thing pretty well. It's just a regular finesse worm. It's got that little point on the end of it. Um, that's actually perfect for drop shot. Yeah, you can throw it on shaky end and stuff, um, but I would totally drop shot that. It's something that I would drop shot. Um, as you guys know, I'm used to drop shot like robo worms and stuff, but definitely we'll give this a try on a drop shot. You can also fish that on Texas rigs, anything like that. Um, these are by Fish Hog, and this is um, Watermelon red and has a chartreuse tail. This is a curl tail worm. You can pretty much fish it on a shaky head. You can fish it on a Texas rig. You can heck, you can fish it on a drop shot. Um, really anything Carolina rig. So it's pretty good all around worm. And I really love watermelon red. It's one of the standard colors. And also it has the chartreuse tail. So pretty nice. And for you guys that don't dye your tails or buy worms that have a chartreuse tail. It's a really great idea. Um, honestly, I think it helps a lot. And we don't use like the um, JDA's Magic and stuff like that like in the bottle. Because if you spill that on your boat, you're pretty much screwed. Um, what we use is pretty much a marker. And you can get it in like chartreuse, red, orange. You can get it in all colors. Um, it's pretty much the same. You're not going to spill it all over your boat. Next thing is one of these penetration hooks. It says on the back, you can pretty much use it for anything. Fluke, lizard, worm, finesse, flipping, stuff like that. It's a regular hook. And the last bait in the box is by Tough Bait. And this one's called Stick. This is pretty much just regular standard stick bait. This is actually a little sample pack. Um, has four different colors in there. I guess it's so you can try out other baits and see what color you would like. But um, as of that, just a standard old stick bait. Can't go wrong with that. You can always whack your rig. You guys know this. Pretty much like a go-to bait. Really tough. Some shallow water. You can use a weighted whack rig for a little bit of deeper water. Um, if you never fish a whack rig, definitely fish a whack rig. You can also fish it weightless, which I should make a video over that if I'm ever fishing somewhat shallow. That's pretty much everything in this month's box, and as you guys know, they have the card which tells you everything. They have an MTV sticker, they have um, the match, and also where you can get your first box for $5. So that's pretty much everything in this month's box. Pretty decent box. I like the river to see stuff as well. I can use those worms to drop shot and such. Um, but going over everything with the prices, the spit and wall, which is the frog, the popping frog, retails at $10.49. Um, that's by River to Sea. So their baits are pretty high quality. Um, the live wire buzz bait is $6.49. The stick by Tough Bait is $3.33, and that's for the sample pack that they have, which is four. 
Then the regular finesse worm by Charlie's Worms, the one that I said I would drop shot, which it says is new as well, is $2 for a four pack, which is also a sample pack. And then the hooker worm by Fish Hog is $1.50 for six pack. And lastly, the penetration hooks for that two pack is $1.60. So that's everything in this month's box. If you guys enjoyed the video, please give the video a thumbs up. And if you want me to do an MTV Slam sometime, give the video a thumbs up. Maybe I should go to a pond or something. Maybe you guys have been wanting to see pond videos. Um, definitely comment below. What do you think? I am really busy right now. So that's why I haven't been posting too many pond videos and lake videos and stuff like that. Like I said, I have tournaments coming up and then I have state championship after this. So I'm just really busy and just trying to get all the footage from um, Kentucky Lake and everything out of the way. Um, I would like to post every single day, you know, but I've had so much going on with school, with work, with kicking, with everything. It's just bunched up and unfortunately I can't get all those videos done so quick. Um, so thank you guys for watching. Comment below what you want to see next. See you guys next time. Look, you're from a 10 to a 2. <laughs> Oversized load on this like 20 pound car. I know some girls that should be wearing that sign. I know some girls that should be wearing that sign. I know some girls that should be wearing that sign. It's just following this overloaded truck.